Is it cavalry? Open fire, everybody! Open fire! Hello everyone, Blazehard here coming at you once again with the Mass Effect mod for Armor 3. And in the last episode when we were taking a look at all the individual models for their for the troops and the tanks and all that. I did promise in my next episode I was going to showcase an actual battle so you can see what this mod looks like when everything's trying to kill each other. Now, that being said, after I was I was I talked about that and I posted the video, I sat down going, what could I possibly do that is just going to be absolutely cool that I know everybody is going to enjoy? And I literally sat down for like 2 hours thinking, what could I do? What could I possibly do? And it occurred, I started looking around over on the Discord for not only the Mass Effect mod, but for the Star Wars mod. And people were posting pictures of from the Star Wars mod and from the Mass Effect mod. And one of the Mass Effect pictures actually caught my eye. And the guy that I asked one of the guy, the guy that posted it if I may use his picture as an idea and the whole concept behind it because he had like a little phrase paragraph of what's going on and he said yeah sure you can't go for it just let me know when you post it i was like cool no problem his name is hard to pronounce i i i i'm not even gonna try to attempt because i know i'm gonna butcher it i've sat here for like uh, past five minutes trying to figure out how to pronounce it so i do apologize but you know who you are thank you very much for letting me do this this should be cool now it won't be exactly like his because I don't think I could really replicate it, but it's gonna be damn close. And that is, we're going to be having the System Alliance. This is supposed to take place on Earth in Africa, and um, uh, the System Alliance military is trying to cut off some of the Reaper destroyers that are moving across the land and destroying pretty much everything. There's supposed to be 30 uh, Reaper destroyers moving across land. We're only gonna do two. This is gonna be like a we're going to say like this is going to be like a small little section or a theater, so to speak, of war. This little area is going to be like one division is taking on these Reapers and then say probably a couple miles away. There will be another parts of the military taking those guys on. You know, we're all spread thin. We're, it's not all clustered together. That, that's just my mentality to explain why there's, you know, not this huge epic fight. Well, guess what? Arma can't handle it. Or else I would say, hell yes, you know, 30 Reapers versus fucking 10,000 troops. Let's do it. But sadly, Arma can't do that. Not yet, anyway. Arma 4, please let us be able to do it. Anyways, so I'm, I'm going to have it where the there's going to be two Reapers over here, probably. I don't know exactly where I'm going to have them stand. And then we're going to have them moving across, and we're going to have vehicles firing left and right, trying to take them down. We're going to have aircraft. We're going to have infantry. It's going to be glorious, and I cannot wait. Now, this video is probably not going to be as long as my normal videos, but it's going to be quick and awesome. And it is, I said, I promised I would do something. But uh, I'm going to pause it right here i'm gonna go step away and i'm gonna go build this map and set everything all up so that way you guys don't have to sit around and watch me build it for like you know 35 40 minutes and then only see the end and then see the quick result you guys are gonna just skip right to this result and see the fun action so don't go anywhere folks i'll be right back in just a minute all right we are back and now i have everything set up hopefully Hopefully my computer doesn't crash, and hopefully, you know, I don't die instantly because the Reapers can one-shot everything. Now, I do have this set up. I did test the map out three times. The reason I do that is because I, I like to get an kind of idea of where it's going to go. And actually, one time out of the three times, so one out of three, the humans actually won. And they are able to destroy the Reapers. But the other two times, we absolutely just failed. They just annihilated everything. So it could go in any way, you know, flip of the coin. We could win or we could lose. And for this fight, I am going to be where did I put myself again. Oh, boy, where did I put myself? Right here. So I'm going to be sitting back here up on this little hill, hopefully away from much of the battle. And I'm going to have my uh, little – actually, no, we're going to – uh, we're gonna switch my stuff out to the sniper rifles that way I can see what is going on 
Uh, excuse me for just a moment while I switch that out. And let's go Marines. And let's go, where is it? Sniper. So that will be me. All right. So what we have in store for this, obviously you can see we have the Reapers. And I decided not to give them any infantry because these things are already going to be scary enough as it is to take out. Now, in the future, I might make another little battle uh, video where we can fight in urban setting. Uh, there might be not any of these, but it'll be, you know, their troops on the ground versus our troops. And, you know, it could be fun. I'll definitely bring a Krogan for that. And so what we have here is all these little groups over here are made up of two Makos and three of the heavier vehicle with the cannon and i built oh i didn't build i placed down a group here here there and then one more right there and so they'll take time to get here they'll, they'll slowly funnel in and when i say funnel in you, you'll see why because things will start dying and when everything's dead another group will pop in and try to take a few shots uh we also have two of these groups one here one somewhere over that way uh, of some of the Mantis. They're going to come in and try to give us some air support. Probably not going to really work very well. And then up here, uh, we have four squads ready to rock and roll. They're going to go up and try to hold the line and do what little they can against giant mechs. But they'll shoot at them. You know, it's going to be it's going to look really cool. And then up here, we have four Makos that are going to pretty much just hold the line and tr spray their guns. They're not going to last very long. Uh, so it should be interesting to watch. Now that is it. So without further ado, let's get this party started. Ah oh, man, I really like that loading screen. Oh, it's so nice. All right. So hopefully, we actually have good frames in this. When I was testing the video, it seemed like it was decent, but I didn't have my recording software on, so I don't know what I was at. And now we're getting a good solid 30 or so frames. Not bad. All right, let's get ourselves up here and just watch the mayhem ensue. Let's go into third person and take a knee. There goes the infantry. Look over there. Here they come. Here comes the cavalry, boys. Ha-ha. <laughs> get some. I don't think they care. Bolts are bouncing off. I mean, literally, tank shells are bouncing off. Now, the reason why I'm losing frames here is because of all the explosions. My computer can actually handle this if it wasn't for the explosions. Am I not shooting my rifle? Well, this is an anti person. No weapon. This is not shoot at a reaver weapon. Reaver weapon. Oh, so I shoot him, piss him off, you'll just one shot me. I want to see what happens. There you go. Get him, fly boys. And we still haven't killed them. Oh, we got one. We got one, Reaper. Yeah, yeah, eat shit. Wow, it never goes good this way. And we killed it. Ha ha ha! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. That's really cool. So it seems like we're... It never went this good before. What the hell? 
Ah, uh, that's armor for you. You can do one thing over and over and over, and it's always going to be different every single time. So, yeah, we killed it. Uh, I might... Uh, you know what? I'm going to add one more Reaper and see what happens. Be right back in just a minute. Let's let's see how much mayhem we can cause. <laughs> this will be fun. All right, we're back, and, well, I added more Reapers in, so this is going to be fun. Probably. <laughs> okay, now three Reapers. Let's see what happens. This will be the last look. Here comes the cavalry. Open fire, everybody. Open fire. That was close. Maybe I should take a knee. Yeah, take a knee is a much smarter thing. Definitely losing frames here. Come on, Air Force. You worked last time. Uh, seems like the Air Force is uh, laying into them. Boys, tearing to him. Oh, you got nailed, and then bounced off a Reaper. Comes the next wave. Come on, boys, hit him. All right, one is down. Where our fly boys are really laying into him. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Hey, dude, you're gonna run right into it. No, no. We're all right to the left of it. Might actually win this? Seriously? Wow, the power of YouTube. We win. <laughs> ah, you gotta love it. That one's gonna go down next. I guarantee it. guys right there you're only shooting at that one he's right in front of you shoot that oh, I'm just getting closer go away go away don't look at me you don't see me maybe I should get back a little bit and hide <laughs> All right, that Reaper is down, and that Reaper has just been destroyed. So we win again? Really? Interesting. 
I don't know how many times I tried recording this or, you know, testing out, you know, with everything, make sure everything's working, and we lose every single time. Power YouTube, turn it on, we win. All right, then. Well, that's gonna be, let's, uh, let's hop back to the editing screen real quick, because this is, it's a little loud. I want you guys to be able to hear me properly. Wow, that, that was definitely interesting, to say the least. So that's going to be the end of this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And if you guys have any more cool ideas, uh, let me know in the comment section down below. I'll be happy to test out and possibly, who knows, I might even have that as a video. And uh, for those of who over on the... Um, over on the discord for this mod and the star wars mod if you guys post any cool thumbnails and you're like hey sarge check this out you know l let me know i like looking at all the cool thumbnails and pictures everybody makes over on that over on that discord some people have really good artistic talent and i really like seeing them uh so yeah again hopefully you guys enjoy this and if you guys have any comments suggestions or feedback about this episode or this mod let me know in the comment section down below and as always i will see you guys in the next episode take care guys and remember have a wonderful day